please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance and remain standing for the moment of silence. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Good morning, Bengal Nation. I'm Liza. And I'm Noah. And this is your Bengal Nation News. It's Wednesday, so let's see what Justin has for us in iTech News. It's fun, it's cool, it's iTech News, and I'm Justin Mitchell. Today in iTech News, we're going to be talking about why our iPhones are lying to us about how much battery life they actually have. They probably are lying to us. Our iPhones keep it 99 because it lies to us all the time about battery life. Unless your phone is not an iPhone 6S and 6S Plus, and it keeps it 100. If this is happening, Apple is trying to fix it. The 6S and 6S Plus are strange in which the battery indicator freezes after people change the time manually and change the time zones. Your phone says it's on 50% even though it's about to die. To fix this problem, Apple suggests that iPhone owners restart their phones. If you have your, this problem and you're allowed to have your phone out at this time, you might want to pay attention. Anyways, first iPhone owners restart their phones, then go to settings, tap general, then go to date and time and make sure that set automatically is turned on. If this problem continues, Apple customers should contact Apple support. Well, I hope I've helped you with your many, 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 many iPhone problems. You can go ahead and scratch that problem off the list. iPhone problem 1265 solved, check. Well, this concludes today's iTech news. Now back to our anchors. Justin's will be on campus at lunch in the atrium this Thursday, January 21st, to take orders and answer questions for any senior or junior who is ordering class rings or graduation supplies. The Miss Blythewood pageant will take place on this Saturday, January 23rd at 7 p.m. Tickets are now on sale in the front office. Tickets are $7 in advance and $10 at the door. Do you sing, recite poetry, or act? Consider showcasing your work at the Voices of Our People program. This event will be hosted by the Sand Hills Library February 18th. Take advantage of this great opportunity to promote your talent as well be exposed to other great artists in the area. If interested, please email your name and contact information to Ms. Burns at iburns at richland2.org. Today is Passport Day. Hopefully you dressed warm for your outside activities. The robotics team will be practicing this week from 4 to 7 p.m. for the Palmetto Regional Competition next month in Myrtle Beach. Also, a reminder that the payment for the uh, competition is due this Friday, January 22nd. If you are a junior and think you qualify for the second semester junior lunch privilege, applications may be picked up in room 603. All first semester grades must be 77 or higher. You must have good attendance and no suspensions of any kind. All school fees for the 2015-16 year must be paid in full and you must get your parent guardian's permission. If you're, if you're approved, you will be required to purchase a new ID for $5 from the Media Center. See Mrs. Anton in 603 if you have any questions. Attention all VHS students, are you a great singer? Can you dance? Do you play an instrument or act? Do you have any hidden talents? If you do, you will want to be a part of Global Society's annual talent show on February 18th. 
Come show off your skills at auditions on Wednesday, February 10th. Pick up your application in the main office beginning today. Applications are due Tuesday, February 9th. Please see Mr. Ballantyne, Ms. Matta Warren, or Ms. Maynard for more information. Yearbooks are on sale for $70. Don't miss out on this important keepsake from your high school years. Prices will increase after spring break. See Ms. Wilkins or a member of the yearbook staff, or you can order online at yearbookforever.com. That's all for news. Now let's head to over to sports. Good morning. I'm Justin. And I'm Avery. Good luck to the JV girls and B team and JV boys basketball teams as they travel to play Westwood today. The JV girls will start the action at 5.30. Girls soccer workouts will be today from 4.15 to 5.15. See Coach Kutcher for more details. Boys lacrosse tryouts will begin on Monday, January 25th, 2016, starting at 4 p.m. Any questions, contact Coach Rates. The Bengals wrestling program would like to congratulate three of their wrestlers who will be competing for JV State Championships this Saturday at Lexington. Freshman Andrew May, sophomore Christian Lance, and freshman Lee McMillan. Good luck as you guys train and prepare for this week. That's all for sports. Now let's check in with Liza for today's weather and your bingo birthdays. Good morning, I'm Liza with your bingo weather and birthdays. Currently, it's a cold 32 degrees and it will warm up to just 44 this afternoon. Dress warm again tomorrow morning as it will be 34 degrees as we arrive to school. That's all for weather. Let's wish happy birthday to those students who celebrated yesterday and who are celebrating today. Jabril Ba, Tra Trayvon Kalman, Al Alnya Kelly, Maya Williams, David Wilson, and Jordan Ross. If you missed any part of today's show, you can watch it again on our blog, www.bhsroarnation.blogspot.com, and you can follow us on Twitter at BHS Bingle News. That's all for today. Have a great start to second semester, Bingles.